Hey everyone, how you doing today? God bless you. This is Pastor Moses Barrios, uh, Senior Pastor of Calvary by the Sea, pronouns he, him and his, and it is good to be connected this way. I just wanted to uh, offer some announcements, some thoughts on stuff that is coming here at Calvary by the Sea, uh, and hopefully you can join us and be part of it. So, uh, let's start off first with um, Ohana groups. So <clears throat> many of you who are here at the church often or have been hearing about Ohana groups, these are like our new kickoff uh, for uh, what we would, you would probably know them as small groups or um, in, in my Spanish tradition, we used to call these celulas or grupos pequeños. Uh, and it's just, uh, it's just a, a small group of people who would get together and be in community, in conversation, in laughter, in joy, have some food, read some scriptures, pray for each other, uh, you know, maybe study a book. In fact, what we're studying is um, The Universal Christ by Richard Rohr. So uh, if you haven't purchased this, uh, please get in contact with Mieko Takata, who's our parish administrator, and she could connect you with one of these books. That's what we'll be reading. Um, and so if you have not yet signed up for an Ohana group, you can do that by going online to uh, calvarybythesea.org. And right there, they should say Ohana groups, and it'll give you options where to go and, uh, you know, be able to sign up for an Ohana group. So we're excited about this. I encourage you to join. Um, <clears throat> if you have more questions around all of that, you can certainly contact anyone here at uh, at Calvary by the Sea of our staff or our associate ministers or or me, Aiko, or myself. So we're all here to support you. It's exciting. It's coming and it's good. And I'm, you know, I'm pumped for it. You know what I mean? By the way, like, um, if you don't get very far in this, that's not the point. Like the whole point is that you build relationships, connect with each other, and please pray for each other. Like just, you know, like spend some time and just be, um, be Christ to one another. All right, so I don't wanna to get too spiritual, okay? So here we go. I'll keep going to the next piece. There is a new sermon series that is beginning this Sunday, August 6th. Uh, it's titled The Fiction About Truth. Now, we're gonna be tackling this for about seven weeks. Uh, Minister Grace and I and Minister Eric will all kind of be part of this series, but I'm gonna kick it off and speak a little bit about uh, truth and, and what that looks like and uh, certainly, uh, perhaps begin to uh, maybe expand um, our understanding of what is truth and what is not truth, right? Uh, I think we get bombarded by so many things um, through social media, through uh, the news, um, through, I mean, some of you all get your news from TikTok, so I guess through TikTok, um, but wherever you kind of get, you know, um, information, uh, I wonder how much of it is truth and how much is fiction <laughs> all right so that it starts this sunday i encourage you to come sundays at 10 a.m um another couple of things that I, I think is important for us to uh realize today thursday i'm recording this thursday morning here um is our food bank angel network charities is back and so what does that mean we get to feed thousands of people in our island uh through nu nutritious foods and if you are available to volunteer that happens Thursdays uh, from 1 to 3 p.m. and it's every other Thursday or I guess the first and third Thursday of each month and then um, every Friday at 10 a.m. we we do the same we uh, feed folks and pass out food so if you have time to volunteer come be part of it um, if not if you know someone who's in need someone who is perhaps hungry or seeking um, some assistance uh, with when it comes to nutrition and food, please send them our way. Okay, so Angel Network Charities, if you have more questions about that, you can certainly contact us here at the office. And then lastly, um, by the way, just a shout out to all our volunteers who are out there at Angel Network Charities. You are the bomb. <laughs> I haven't said that since like, like in the early 2000s. Anyways, um, Food Bank is back. And then ne next thing is the Sunday School is back. So this Sunday at 10 a.m., Sunday School is back. So parents, bring your kids, uh, preschool to fifth grade. There is Sunday School for them. I will be giving a children's message and be giving away uh, these um, 
the, these mustache stickers uh, that that I, I don't know if you know this, but where I came from, um, the, before I, I was, the kids would call me Pastor Mustache because of my mustache, and it was much longer. It isn't as long now, but I, I I'm headed that way. Okay, kids, I'm headed that way, um, and so kids will receive a free mustache sticker on Sunday if they come and participate for that. And then Wednesday, Wednesday, August 9th, uh, our youth is back. So Minister Eric um, and Minister Grace will be leading our youth ministries there for students in junior high and high school. So again, parents, uh, friends, if you know somebody in that age group, entering that age group, I would encourage you to invite them and to uh, include them because it is a cool time, a really fun time. All right. Well, I think I'll stop there. Blessings to you. Remember to take deep breaths in. Remember that you are loved, that God is well pleased with you. And remember that you are wonderfully made. And for that matter, that is good, good, good news today. So blessings to you. Much love, much love, and hope to see you around. Bye.